Naughty Gang, Naughty Gang, Naughty Gang. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be going over how you can get the easiest coins possible in Madden 22. If you're new to the channel, drop a thumbs up on the video. It helps the channel out a lot and it's free. If you are OG of the channel, drop a thumbs up on the video as always and comment down below Naughty Gang. Make sure your notifications on. We're going to get into some shout outs. First shout out goes to Just Magics. Another shout out, Aggie Skate 11. Another shout out to my boy Hut. If you want a chance to be shouted out in the video, all you got to do is be active, be subbed with your notifications on, go in the comment section, and write Naughty Gang. Let's get into the breakdown. This is your one stop shop for all Madden needs. Whether you're looking for some fly merchandise, you're looking for ebooks, you're looking for a Patreon membership, or you just want to become part of the Tutty Squad. I appreciate all the love and support. Everything is in the link in the description. Let's get it. All right, the number one easiest way to make coins right now with no new promos, no new rerolls in the game is your solo challenges. The solo challenges that I'm talking about is the legend solo. So if you play solo 18, solo 19, and solo 20, that's gonna give you a legend token and power-ups now it's a lot of people that don't like the grind solos they think solos are boring this is going to take you about 10 to 15 minutes and it's going to give you a power-up those power-ups can go from 3,000 to 5,000 coins so this would be an easy 15 to 20 K now also once you do these solos it's going to give you 87 or 88 overall players you can take them 87 and 88 overall players and put them into an exchange or you can take them same pieces put them into that same legend set try to snipe the highest card like a 93 overall for about 120 to 125 you can finish the entire set get the best pieces for cheap and then you can make about a 50 to 60 thousand profit i'm gonna finish this solo real quick and i'm gonna show you exactly what i'm talking about all right so i'm finishing up the last solo right now we're gonna exit out of the game we're gonna get our rewards and then i'm gonna show you what you can do with the players in order to make the best profit okay so they are 88 overalls i think so you can automatically quick sell them for half the training that would be one thousand training but you can also take these free power-ups and then you can sell them also especially if they are not cards that you're interested in so you're going to get all these legend strategies which is not important right now so you're going to get these packs the novice legend fantasy packs they are going to contain things plus you're going to get your daily tasks so playing your solos is going to help you get a free coin pack that's going to be free coins yesterday I got a 25,000 coin pack. So just logging on the game, playing your dailies, give you an opportunity to make coins every single time, okay? And it gives you a chance to be able to level up. So after you do all that, I have unopened packs and I have these Novice Legend Fantasy Packs. They also gave me a free Elite Pack and they gave me an uncommon strategy item, okay? Plus this one, so I can quick sell this one for a thousand coins. I can quick sell this one for nine thousand coins. I can open up the free elite pack just playing the game and leveling up. And then these right here are gonna be nine auctionable legend pieces. And like I said, you go up in here, you pick two different legends that you want, either the 88 Walter Payton or the 88 Mel Renfro. Okay, so Walter Payton will probably be more expensive, so I'm gonna take his 88. So the second pack, we're going to get two 88s right here. I'm going to take Junior because his legend set is more expensive than Frank Wycheck. You can also go to your binder and you can take these cards and you can individually do them for training. So they're going to go for half value. So for each one of these cards, it's going to give you 1,090 training if you don't want the 88 overalls. You can use them for rerolls that will be coming into the game just like this right here. I got this free 96 PJ Williams for maxing out the level. I was on level 46 last night. I played a couple legend solos for this video and then now I just finished them off in some kind of way I went up four levels instead of two. So we got the 88 roll mode that we can quick sell. We get this 96 PJ Williams. You get his power up for free or you can sell it. So if you go to PJ Williams power up, you can sell his power up for 4,000 coins. That's a free 
4,000 coins just from playing the game. If you came to Walter Payton, his power up. If somebody don't want to play the solos, you can sell his for another free 4,000 coins, okay? And then they all quick sell for training. So if I took this one, quick sell it for training, that would be 9,250 training, okay? That's a lot of training for rerolls or to power up another player. Also, you can take them same pieces and you can put them into sets. So if I went to exchange with the player exchange, you can go all the way to the bottom, 89 to 90 overall exchange. You're gonna take more of a risk, but with these cards, you can sell them off for a profit, okay? So you can put all three of them pieces in that you just got for free. You can put the 88 right here, 88 and 88. All three of them in for free because you can't do nothing with them but quick sell them or try to complete the set. So you can put all three of them in and take a chance of getting an 89 to 90. If you get a 90, that would be between 50 and 65,000 coins. If you pull an 89, that will only be 30,000 coins but like I always say, 30,000 coins is 30,000 coins. So you have a chance at making a lot of coins just from playing the game, playing your solos, selling the power up. So if you get the bare minimum, 89 overall, sell it for 28 to 30,000, sell all the power ups from these legends, you're going to be having 40 to 45,000 coins super, super fast. Drop a thumbs up on the video if you enjoyed it. And we'll be back with the next program drop tomorrow with more coin methods. Let's get it.